What's up everyone, I'm Michael. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. In this video, I figured I'd focus on something that I love wearing as it gets hotter and hotter. And that's just a simple button down. You can't go wrong with it. I'm just gonna give you all some different ways and different visuals on how to style it. So let's go ahead and get into it. So as I said, you just can't go wrong with a button down. There are a ton of different ways to style them. I like to just keep it pretty just simple and casual when I wear my button downs. I usually have the sleeves rolled up like I always talk about. And I'm usually gonna be wearing it with like some chino shorts or some jeans or some chinos, like the pants. And, or maybe like some dress pants. You know, like some pleated pants or dress pants, slacks, whatever you wanna call it. I usually just kinda keep it to that range. That's pretty much every type of clothing that I could think of really. Pretty much anything except sweatpants I'm gonna wear a button down with. It, I feel like that's an easier way to slim, simplify it. Anyway, jumping on into the first outfit here, this one is just a pretty casual example of a way to style it and this is with jeans here. And I just love a light blue button down. I feel like that's kind of the most common one that I see uh, like during the spring and summer season and I'm not sure why but it just gives a super lightweight and casual vibe. I don't know how to describe it really but as you see here, this is just a very simple outfit. Like I said, a blue and white stripe button down. He has like the top three or four buttons unbuttoned, as you can see. He's wearing a tank top under that. Uh, some regular pants. I wanna say these are probably like a Dickies or Carhartt. You can see like the loop for the hammer, I think it is technically. But anyway, the loop on the side of the pants. And he paired those with some Adidas Sambas. And in regards to accessories, I see all the different necklaces. It's good to wear all your necklaces. Well, not all, but in moderation, wear some necklaces. If you want to wear a single one or two, or you want to have a stack like me, I usually wear all three of these necklaces together. Just a regular simple one, the cross and the Dominican necklace. But anyway, uh, I also see a ring that he has on and the headphones, if you want to count that as an accessory. But, you know, just wearing all those different accessories in moderation to make the outfit look better. Now this next one here is another good option for wearing a short sleeve button down and I know when you think of button downs you really don't think of short sleeve ones but those are still button downs technically. I know a lot of people call these button up and the long sleeve ones are more button down but to me one is long sleeve one is short sleeve they're both button downs and as you see here this is kind of like a purplish color I guess kind of like a plaid purple button down. Under that he has on just a plain black tee and he paired that with just some light wash jeans and these Birkenstock clogs and this isn't actually the reason I showed it. I showed it because it was a short sleeve button down but usually whenever I show an outfit that has clogs in it that's the main reason I'm showing it. And in regards to accessories I see he has on the beanie so that kind of gives a spring vibe to it too like you know it's like not too hot to wear a beanie and it's also not too cold because he has on short sleeves so you know it's just kind of that perfect middle ground for the spring season and yeah so I have the bracelet I don't know if I mentioned that but this is just a perfect spring outfit here now this isn't exactly the full outfit here but you can just see part of it you can see the majority of the outfit really except for the shoes and this is the outfit by Manu Rios I like his style I get a lot of inspo from you know just his casual wear and street wear just seeing you know the normal his day-to-day -day things that he would wear and he just has a pretty muted I guess well not muted but a usual just kind of trendy style but also it's just pretty casual and a lot of the things he wears can be worn to a variety of occasions and as you see here this is just kind of a lavender or lilac colored button down and he has like the top two or three buttons unbuttoned and un under that he has on just a plain white tee and I feel like that's just another way to wear it during this time of year if you want to have an extra layer during the summer I'm definitely not doing that under a button down but I feel like it could work during the spring season or the fall season and in regards to the pants, these are just kind of those like uh, carpenter pants that the guy had on in the first outfit, as you see that same loop that I was referring to. And in regards to accessories, I'm not really seeing any, but I guess if you do want to go for that clean look, this would be an example of it. Me personally, I'm usually wearing mine just because I feel like it adds an extra pop to the outfit, but it's not bad when you don't wear it, but I just prefer that you have on, you know, different accessories. Now this fourth outfit here, I feel like will be more adequate as the temperatures get warmer and warmer this season. So depending on where you live, it could possibly be adequate for this outfit here, but I feel like a majority of the country is just gonna probably be wearing stuff like this maybe in like late May or could be even early May. Anyway, that's besides the point. Uh, here this guy has on this just uh, short sleeve button down shirt and it's kind of that same blue and white stripe as the first outfit too. Under that he has on a tank top and the tank top is tucked into these pants and these kind of look like those same carpenter pants or carpenter jeans, whatever you want to call it. And these are just kind of a white or cream color pants. and. In regards to the shoes, these look like Birkenstock sandals. I'm not exactly sure if they are or not, but they look like they could be. 
And I want to say they're just, you know, the regular Birkenstock sandal that most people have. Well, not most, but a lot of people have. And in regards to accessories, you see the watch, you see the necklaces, the earrings, so you know, all those different things just to help make that outfit look better. And now here in this last outfit, I want to show this one just because it ties in one of the things that I feel like is kind of controversial, and that's just socks with sandals. Me, I'm a proponent of it. I do love wearing socks with sandals, and I usually don't wear it with outfits that are kind of dressed up like this. Mine are usually a lot more casual, like I'm usually wearing just a pair of shorts and a t-shirt, and it's just something that I wear just, you know, for a quick outfit. Nothing as put together as this, I would say. I would wear socks and sandals with, but it still just looks nice. I don't know if it's my style, but it's still just a nice outfit. And as you see here, just a regular stripe button down. It just has some different, you know, muted or earth tony colors on it just with the stripe button down. Uh, with the pants, I wanna say these are just some regular dress pants. I can't tell if they're pleated or not. And like I mentioned before, the Birkenstock sandals that he has on with a pair of socks. And in regards to accessories, I'm not seeing any accessory other than the scarf and the hat. I mean, that is a good amount of accessories, but the scarf and the hat are the accessories for the outfit. And it's a good outfit, don't get me wrong, but I'm just not sure how I feel about the socks and sandals with this outfit here, but it doesn't look bad, if that makes sense. So those are just some different ways that I want to show you all how to style button downs as we head into the summer season. I know that's a long way away, but it's just going to be getting warmer and warmer. So I'm just referring to the warmer temps as summer season. But anyway, I hope you all found some inspo to this in this video. Don't forget to like this video if you did enjoy. Subscribe to my channel because I post on here twice a week. And follow me over on Instagram as well at Micah Aikens just so you can keep up with me. See everything that I'm doing. See what I'm wearing. And I will see you all in the next video.